If you're going to use the Expedition for five days or more, or if you're going to store it between 48 hours to a week, you want to follow these simple cleaning instructions. First, I'll show you the procedure assuming that you have access to clean water to use for flushing. The first step is to empty the system from both the blue and the red port. Next, fill both sides with potable water. Then, open the red port and dump the water back out. Close the red port again. Next, add one bottle of sodium metabisulfite through the blue port. Close the blue port and shake the bag. Then remove the bite valve from the drink tube. Attach the opened end of the squeeze bulb that came with the system. Squeeze the bulb until you pump all the fluid out of the blue port side. Open the blue port to break the vacuum, then reclose for storage. You can now store the system for up to a week. Before using it again though, you'll need to fill the blue side up with water and pump out again to remove any excess sodium bisulfite. Now if you don't have access to potable water, the cleaning process is going to be a little bit different. You're going to use the water that's on the blue port side to clean the system. Remember, never add dirty water to the blue port side. Now, you may be wondering why it is that you're going to have clean water on the blue port side. When you're not drinking from the bite tube, the system is still producing water across the membrane into the blue side. This will be the water, the dilute sports syrup, that you will need to use to flush the cartridge. So after you empty the red port when you start the cleaning procedure, add one bottle of metal bisulfite to the blue port side. Then shake and pump out with the squeeze bulb. The system can then be stored for a week. When you use the system again, fill the red port side with dirty water, then wait 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, attach the squeeze bulb and pump out whatever fluid you can. When storing the system, be sure both ports are closed tightly. This is important so that the membrane does not dry out. 